Oh, we got the boom thing. Oh, okay. okay. Yeah, yeah. Hello, hello. I'm Sam. I am somewhere. And today, that somewhere is, we are at the Burlington Regal for another Out of the Theater movie review. It's Thursday night. That means it's movie night. And tonight's movie is Beetlejuice. Beetlejuice. Beetlejuice could be a Halloween movie. That's three times. Let's jump right into our review. Boom. Hi, Sam. I'm in. This movie has no in credit scenes. Movie like Italian. <laughs> My first reaction, this movie was very interesting overall. Adam up, you're up. What was your first reaction? I'm up. My first reaction was it was kind of like a real sequel. It wasn't like these requels that we've seen lately. To continuation of the story from the from the first movie. Don Solo, what was your first reaction? Uh, very positive. I had low expectations coming in, and I walked away very happy. Let's move on to the positive things. My positive things was I liked the characters that were in the movie. I like the mother that played, that was in Home Alone, the actress that played it, the mother in Home Alone. She did a, a really a good job. And I also like the girl from the show called Wednesday. She did an amazing job. And I also like Michael Keaton, which played as Beetlejuice. He did a great job too. Adam up, what were your positive things? I like the special effects, but not so much because of the CGI. It was more like old school. Um, claymation, the Tim Burton stuff, animation type stuff. It was good to see those type of types of effects, not just all CGI. I like the uh, soundtrack. That it was like a it was like a real orchestra. They weren't using like Taylor Swift music, pop music. Don Solo, what were your what were your positive things? Uh, Adam just took both of mine. Uh, definitely the special effects. It's old school Tim Burton, which I love, and. Um, just uh, the little music numbers, the humor, the, the little paybacks to the original, you know. Like I said, very pleased. I like Beetlejuice 1 and 2. They're both pretty good. Let's move on to the negative things. I'll cut that out. My ne negative thing was we had a screen issue. The screen went off for a couple minutes. That was bad. It's kind of like an intermission. I'm sure Regal was dying of embarrassment. And I don't like... I like the ending in the first movie better because the ending in the first Beetlejuice movie, they play the song called Shake, 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 And I also like the part that they didn't, that they didn't have in the new Beetlejuice movie that they play six foot, seven foot, and the big monster thing came out when they were sitting at the dining room table in the original movie. That's the only negative things I have. Adam up. What were your negative things? Can't really think of too many. Maybe it was a little bit slow in the beginning. There's a lot of setup. Uh, but once, like, Beetlejuice became part of the movie, it, like, picked up. Don Solo, what were your ne negative things? Only negative thing I really have is uh, you figured out some of the stuff a little earlier, I think. I'd like to have like, maybe a, another twist or something in there. Not me, I was like the opposite. The guy I thought was dead was alive, and then the guy I thought was alive was dead. Yeah, I don't know. I had it figured out way too soon. For my life. Let's move on to the rating. I would rate this movie nine out, nine out of 10. Adam, what, what would you rate it? I'm gonna go eight, eight out of 10, and because uh, it's something I think I'll watch a lot. Don Solo, what would, what would you rate it? I'm gonna go seven, and uh, I was expecting a lot lower, but it was a good movie, and I liked it. Would you pay to go see it, or nee, you can just wait for streaming? I'll pay to go see it is definitely something I will watch in the theaters and at home. I would pay to go see it because Beetlejuice is an amazing movie. Don Solo, what do you think? I think with Halloween and everything coming up, you should definitely pay to go see it. Wouldn't hurt to bring the kids. They like it. It's not too scary, not too R-rated. Watching it, it kind of what makes me want to go back and watch the cartoon again. I used to like the cartoon when oh, I came Oh, a Beetlejuice? Yeah. Oh wow, Adam. So up. Now I kind of want to go watch the old cartoon. God, you're old. Well, 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 we did it all. For the first time in how long? 
When was the last time we were we did a review? It was Harold in a Purple Crayon. <laughs> that was before we went to Disney. Yeah, vacation. Yeah. yeah. Been lonely here without y'all. <laughs> we're back. Well, well, well. We did it all. We took care of the chicken business, we watched a movie, and we talked about it. Nice work, pal. Stay tuned for more out of the theater movie reviews coming to my channel very soon. So if you enjoyed tonight's movie review, please hit the like button. And you can subscribe anytime because it's free for you. Alrighty then. Thanks for watching and we will see you real soon!